Look at him, y'all. <clears throat> y'all know what time it is, man. It's your boy, I know, but I know, and I'm not even gonna act like I didn't already see it live. We watched the replay, we watched the highlights, but we see it. African champs in the UFC. Israel Adesanya. We got my boy, uh, fucking, uh, oh, my, oh, my watch, fucking, Kamaru Usman. And now we got, finally, finally, Francis Ngannou taking down an amazing, amazing champion in Stipe Miocic. I, you already, you could feel it, you could tell. See how my watch is telling me? I feel like Stone Cold Steve Austin. It was time. Time was coming. Time was ticking. And just, man, my boy, the most terrifying thing about this fight is you have this man looking like a goddamn vet. Look at him. Look at, at look at African Hulk. Afri Yo. Looking like Thanos, African father. I don't know. This he should not. The, terrified. This man could just. If this man will miss you with a punch and knock your ass out. That's how powerful this thing is. Can you imagine how the kind of hands you have to have to literally the shadow of the punch will knock your ass out. Like him thinking about the punch will knock your ass. That's how much. That's the power in this nigga's hand. Y'all see the African. This man got the punching power of his entire ancestry. Okay, this is this this man. You know y'all be talking about black people all the time the black power fist. No, that was the black power. This man punching for every single slave, monopolized human being in human history. This shit got like y'all. Look at my boy, look at Stipe, look at my boy. Yo, he out here, yo, he's got, he's got a chin now. That boy is tough as shit. Look at him, he brought the kiss him across. Like, yo, I already always appreciate a man of faith. But you know, Stipe, my goodness, Lord. Oh, my, this fight's crazy. Look at, look at the guy, look at him. He look like that, um, what's his name? Y'all know, I don't know who the, the name is, but I'll put the name right there. What do you look like? I'm just so, I'm excited, bro. We got three African UFC champions, man. Oh, my goodness. This Bruce Bruffle, we ain't got time for your ass either. Yo, we just, oh, man, it's Liddy out here. Oh. Let's go, nigga. We, let, we, let's look at him. Yo, he got the John Cena haircut right now. I don't really know, but yo, this, Bruce Buffer still talk. I bet y'all see y'all let Bruce Buffer talk for goddamn thirty minutes. Like this shit, this intro take longer. Than, yo, this intro longer than a fight, man. We, see, pay me, oh yeah. Okay, let's go. We got Herb Dean out here. But, yo, I didn't even know Herb Dean. Y'all you know Herb Dean was a fighter? Y'all probably know that, but I didn't know that until uh, fairly recently that he has the MMA career. That was actually not too bad, you know? He could, so that makes him a really good qualified referee. I mean, there's a reason why I guess he's the best. I mean, he's really out here. I don't think there's any other uh, referees that I know of that have actually competed. So, and on a high level, too. So, but anyways, yo, look at these. Oh, my gosh. Look at him, bro. Oh, yo, this fight. Big boy fight, yo. Heart thumping in this bitch. Yo, I just, yo. She even reliving it. I'm still, oh, I'm still, yo, look at my shit. My shit like this, yo, I can tell. Never off gold character since he was, so, he was so patient and tactical, picking him apart, pick, like he didn't go, didn't spill the gas. Because I thought the shit was going to go, I thought the shit was going to go at least third, fourth round because Stipe just seems to like know how to just stay out of danger. Like, you know, like he like he get, he gets caught. Like, because in my opinion, when it comes to the better fight, I think Engano is the better fighter. I think he has so many devastating weapons, and Stipe was just he's just able to outlast it all. He can outlast the onslaught, which is to his credit. But like, I feel like you know he would have been able to last even. I, I, don't, I don't know because at this point, Stipe didn't look like he's ever been wobbled to me. Like he'd been hit, but really stopped. He never looked like he got stopped the way he got stopped in this fight. But yo. Look at, look at my boy, leg kicks, he look like a, oh my, he's technical and he's a beast, y'all, woohoo, y'all don't know, man, it's lit out here, oh my goodness, yo. look at him, woohoo, spinning back fist, oh my, I'm getting hyped, because someone this big and terrified should not be this technical, I mean, this, this moment, he's an Avenger, I'm telling y'all, when did he come, is he gonna be a winter soldier, that's all I wanna know, that's, yo, look at this, is he gonna be on, ooh, ooh, look, I'm, oh, that shit, but how does Stipe take that shot, y'all? How does Stipe take that shot? This shit buckle man. It's like I don't know how to feel, yo. But he's still in it, yo. And he don't even look really hurt. He out here just chilling. He out here the eye for eye. Like how do Stipe's jaw and faces must be made out of must be made out of 
evolution as a fighter. Cancel culture, because I don't know. No, I don't. I don't know what I meant by that. I'm, I'm, I'm just. Yeah, I'm, I'm, my, my head is spinning. Look at him stuff that takedown tech. Ooh, float around. Lunch box to the face. Look, guys, y'all, do y'all see this? Do you see this man technically? Can you imagine a man this powerful and technical whooping your ass? Shout out Stipe for just for just showing up because honest to God, to even I get a look at this man, I would be t I would I'm shitting my pants and I'm not even I, I'm not even a part of this. This is that bullshit. Look at him. Oh my goodness, Stipe, and he's out here chilling still. He still look like he just he, Sunday morning jog. I don't know y'all. This shit, yo. Look at Francis being paid. Look, he would have, he, he could have, like, went and rushed him. And, oh my, throwing leg kicks. Oh my God. Yo, this piece of beast throwing leg kicks. I just, yo, I can't, I can't handle this shit. Look at him, bro. A lot of patience here. Look at this. Three and a half minutes in. Look, man, honestly, Stipe don't know. Stipe just trying to out, like, trying to let him spill out the gas. I think that's Stipe's only plan in this. And it's like, man. It just, you're fighting a different beast right now. You're a beast that has learned, and it, that is absolutely horrifying for anybody. And I know John Jones is next. I know John Jones is going right to heavyweight. I know he's going right for him, but, and I love John Jones, but good Lord have mercy. This, it, I, this is, might be the only time I can doubt, you know, the GOAT. Because John Jones, make no mistake, John Jones is the GOAT. Y'all can hate all y'all want, but John Jones is the GOAT of this shit. Y'all can talk about steroids, y'all can talk about the past. None of that matters. None of that actually means anything when it comes to his actual performance. Like, that, you can't... You, honestly, if people talk about the Roids and all people. The Roids don't... I don't think Roids really have that much of an impact on the fight. Let's be honest, guys. And the way he's dominating the fight. It's not like he's outsizing his opponents. You know, it's not like he's taking, getting quicker recovery and being able to fight more fights and stuff. Nah, no, guys. The, at the end of the day, it's skill and timing and, 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 and conditioning and all those things that win those fights. The amount of pictos in the system, don't, I don't think it really makes much of a difference. So, y'all trying to discredit someone's success because of that is stupid. You know? And, and the thing is, when people were getting caught for Usada or whatever it's called, like, there was a lot of people getting caught for that. You know, everyone was getting caught for that stuff. And, like, Except for the guys in the lighter divisions because maybe they don't need that type of stuff, baby. But either way, it's substance that, that just got switched over, got banned. They changed the rules. A lot of people are caught in the Does that mean they're deliberately cheating? No, that could have been stuff that they were taking that was okay before that all of a sudden isn't okay now. So it is what it is, y'all. All right, so yeah. Oh my goodness, he just ate a left hook like it was nothing. I don't understand how steep they takes this shit. I, I do not. Like, this man got the chin of a thousand. Oh my goodness, not anymore. Oh lord, he didn't and God will say F what I was gonna say. Oh my goodness. Sending him back. Oh hold up. Y'all 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 can't see it uh, with this angle. But my boy's leg. My boy looked like he was trying to slide tackle in FIFA. I don't know. My boy was trying to do a drop kick to the flow. Y'all, the way my boy Stipe, his leg, his leg said get bent. I just that shit was that when I tell you terrifying African strength, I just this man, that's, that's too much power. I'm so happy to see a guy like Ngannou win. Not since Brock Lesnar, as there been a guy that just physically, like, just captures everyone's UFC imagination of what like, heavyweight really should be. And that boy looked like he belonged in a Marvel, DC, Dragon Ball Z universe. I don't... Y'all, I was so happy to see. And look, Kamaru Uzman was in his corner. You know, Israel Adesanya, you know, their friend, he was helping him out too. They helped each other. I just love to see, you know, the camaraderie and the brother you know, between all three of these guys and you know I just really love it it just it's, it was close to show what could happen when we all come together you know especially you know people like me but um, that's besides the point y'all I hope y'all enjoyed the video I'm just here just to be lit and just to enjoy um, him winning um, I really wanted you know obviously him to, to finally you know just get some gold I feel like he always deserved that so yeah it's, I'm, I'm glad to see it and I uh, hope y'all enjoyed the video and if you did like comment subscribe and know how y'all felt about this fight and please check out my other videos so, like, we react to a lot of UFC Francis content, so, yeah, hope y'all enjoy it, we'll see y'all next video. Oh, yeah, I just had the hiccups.